Good morning. Happy Tuesday. It is Tea Tuesday. And happy birthday to me. Today I am 47 years young. So welcome back to Home Life with Rebecca. I am having some peppermint tea. I woke up not feeling the best, which all of my kids have been sick. We've had ear infections, bronchitis. We got tested for the flu. <laughs> Luckily nobody had the flu, but so I've got some peppermint tea in here because I just woke up feeling kind of nauseous and icky. I did manage to get like a semi workout in. I got really off track when my mother-in-law and brother-in-law and niece were here, which, which is fine. It happens when company comes. I'm drinking my peppermint tea from this pretty pioneer woman um, cup that my husband got me for my birthday. And I was gonna go get my nails done today and then go talk to some people at Club Pilates. Um, they offered me a free class to come check it out. I was kind of on the fence to do it because I'm afraid if I like it, then I'll wanna sign up, but I don't know how much it costs or anything, but it is a free class. You know, I'm all about free. Um, today I'm wearing my dad's ashes. Um, my sister and brother-in-law purchased this for me. Uh, it's my dad's favorite color. Um, oh, every holiday's hard. My birthday feels hard. Last year was the first year that I hadn't heard from my dad on my birthday or the day after my birthday because my dad always got my birthday confused. For some reason, he always thought I was born March 27th, 1978, which, hey, that makes me a year younger, so I'm fine with that. So, but it was always a joke between us because I'd have to call him on my birthday and we would just laugh about it. Um, uh, last year, that didn't happen. In fact, the last text I ever got, I told myself I wasn't gonna cry. The last text I ever got from my dad was March 25th, so a year ago yesterday, where he said, I love you to the moon and back, baby girl. Um, and I still have that text on my phone and I've just got a screenshot just in case it accidentally deletes, but I thought today would be good to wear my dad's ashes. So, yeah. Um, I meant to vlog when my in-laws were here. Um, I've had a, <laughs> I think I have like, a minute of footage when we walked over to the pizza pie cafe restaurant down the street from our house because we went out to it's like a buffet um I just I don't know I forgot I just didn't do it I just spent time talking and enjoying their company and I I didn't get a video so I I do apologize because it's been like over a week since I've posted but so my husband got me this for my birthday and then he got me these really cute pioneer woman magnetic we're sticking to stuff magnetic uh you know you can put them on chips or bags but i thought that was really sweet i love her stuff with the cup and then he got me a very nice card so he got me a card and i also got a card from kristen one of my subscribers on here who actually went to high school with my husband believe it or not talk about a small world. She went to high school with my husband Adam in Northern California. Um, she found our YouTube channel and uh, we are also pen pals. So she sent me a really nice birthday card. Thank you, Kristen. And Kennedy made me a card. It says, I love you. Have a great day. Love, Kennedy. She used some of my stickers, put those on there. And then my daughter Jillian wrote me a really nice letter this morning and god bless her she is so sweet she doesn't have any money right now so she gave me this little jewelry box that i had somebody i think one of her friends gave it to her for valentine's day she's like you can just have it mom I, i'm gonna give it back to her but i thought that was so sweet she also went into all the coloring books and i think she out of the kids coloring books and she tried to find um a coloring book that hadn't been used um that she thought i would enjoy and she got this she left this one on my bed with the jewelry box, the little mommy and me coloring book. And I, I thought that was so sweet. And this like Monet painting. And this actually, believe it or not, my dad bought this for the kids um, when we took a trip 
to the art museum in Pasadena when I was homeschooling my kids back in like oh, 2014, I want to say. I think it was maybe 2015. Um, and nobody's colored in it. Um, but this is from my dad. So I thought that was really sweet. Those, those kind of presents that she kind of just went around the house to try to find things that nobody has really used and wrote me a nice letter and gifted that to me. So, so sweet. Um, and then oh, my husband bought me some Nerd Gummy Clusters, which are going in there because I've been trying to be good. And I did have some of that candy a few days ago and I, it actually made me feel sick. So I think that's a good thing because I'm trying to get that stuff out of my system. But um, I'll share it with the kids tonight. I think I'm going to make myself a cake um, for me and my husband today because his birthday is on Friday, but we are spending the night at a hotel, um, kind of as a birthday gift to ourselves, a night away from the kids. We're gonna go out to dinner and that's gonna be Friday night. He is sick, he's at the doctor's right now, so I'm hoping that he's better for us to go, but he was like, we're going even if we're sick, even if that means we just sleep in the hotel and get rest because it's non-refundable. And I'm like, that's, that's fine, but. Hopefully both of us feel better. I hope this, whatever I have passes, I just feel just nauseous. Um, what else was I gonna show you? Oh, so my earrings today are a little owl. So I spent, I can't even remember what I spent on Timu. Um, it wasn't any more than like 15 bucks, but I told Adam it would be for my birthday present. I wanted to get some more earrings and so Kennedy, really wanted to get me something for my birthday she wanted to get me something owls um because I do love owls and so when I got the earrings I picked out a pair of earrings some owl earrings and some rainbow ones I gave them to Adam so she could give them to me and she <laughs> I should have got it on um on this this morning she was so excited to give me these earrings and I had to put them on right away and she was like telling her bus driver it's my mom's birthday and look at the earrings that I got her with my dad's money and <laughs> It was really, really cute, but, and I don't know if you guys can see, but it's got lots of little colors in it and they're just really cute. So I've got, so I got these pair, one, two, three, four, five, six. I got seven pairs of earrings, that's including these. So I'm gonna show those to you as well. But I wanted to show you my son Parker and my daughter Tiffany went in on a gift and they got me this really nice candle. It smells really good, it's called Island Moonlight. Yeah, this smells, smells very nice. And then I've been talking about buying a family calendar to hang on the fridge or hang up on the wall somewhere out there so that they can write down their work schedules and like their school schedules. And I've got one son doing track now. Just, oh my gosh, because I have such a hard time even in my planner, just keeping everything on in track. And sometimes they don't always get back to me. So I thought if I had something like that, they can go ahead and fill that in for me and then I can go put that in my planner. It would be up where everybody could see it. So, cause it's just been crazy with appointments. So they both went in and got me this really nice family calendar that we can fill it, fill it in. It's got some magnets on it so you can hang papers on it as well. And then they did buy me some dry erase markers to go with it. So I was really pleased. Um, my daughter Allie is sick super sick in bed, I had to take her to the doctors yesterday. She's got like really bad like sinus infection, so she's on antibiotics, so <laughs> she is asleep. So I, usually she makes me a card or something, so I, I don't expect anything from her today because she is so sick. I don't expect anything from any of my kids, um, but truth be told, it is nice when, when they remember. Uh, Wesley, he's my almost 15 year old. <laughs> this morning he was like, we were waiting to, he was waiting to leave for school. And he was like, whose birthday is it? And I was like, I don't know whose birthday is it? He like, I keep saying, keep hearing Kennedy talk about somebody's birthday. I'm like, yeah, who, who she saying it to? He's like, I thought she was saying it to you. He goes, but whose birthday is it? And I'm like, I don't know Wes, if she's saying it to me, whose birthday is it? He goes, is it your birthday? And I'm like, yeah, he goes, it is. He's like, I didn't know that. Oh, that was laughing so hard. It was just, it's just my like typical like boy behavior. Um, in fact, I'm pretty sure Parker, my 17 year old son, would have forgotten too if he hadn't been with his sister Tiffany at Walmart last night. <laughs> so I, that's totally fine. They are, they are so cute. Um, 
So I'm going to show you the earrings that I picked out and my lovely locket, my dad. I I miss him so much. I'm still really liking my hair. Just feels really nice. It's easy to wash, easy easy to comb. So let's look at the earrings. So okay, I'll take it off so you can see better. So first we got the little owls that I knew Kennedy would love to get me. Oh, and my mom, I went on my email this morning to call her. She sent me a $50 gift card to Amazon. And I've been wanting to get some like yoga pants and stuff. So I might go on there and do that later. Did I already say I was going to go get my nails done today? But I think I did. It depends on how my stomach is feeling. And because it's not been feeling great. So hopefully I can do that. If not, I'm going to wait and do it Friday before we go out on Adam's birthday. I got these really pretty butterfly earrings. I wanted to do some summery stuff, springy stuff with that coming up. Um, again, I think this is the uh, Shrinkadinks, right? but they do a really good job on it. And so far, at last video I made on the earrings, I thought that they were kind of cheap feeling, but I've had no problems, especially with my hair shorter. They don't catch in it. I've had no problems, and so it's been good. Um, here's some more little Shrinkadink ones. I, mean, I don't know if that's what this is, but that's what it feels like to me or what it looks like. These cute cat, colorful cat earrings. I've been obsessed with like cat things lately too. I don't know why cats and gnomes, I don't know. My taste is just really all over the place. I That's why I don't think I want to have just one theme. It's just kind of everything I like goes. My, my poor husband, because he's like, well, I want to hang up uh, sports stuff. And I'm like, oh, that doesn't match. I'm like, you can put that in the garage. <laughs> so, that's so mean. I should, he should have, uh, you know, a shelf. <laughs> Here are the rainbow ones that I knew Kennedy would want to give me. So those, those, I thought those were really cute. Fun and colorful and bright. Here's some more butterfly ones. So we've got some really pretty colors in there. And they're, they're a little bit heavier than the other ones, but not too heavy. I just cannot wear super heavy earrings anymore. Um, these one actually uh match my outfit today too but i'm gonna keep the albums on for miss kennedy um i got these cute cat earrings those were cute they look like my cat jack and then these ones match my outfit today too i thought those were pretty it's got a butterfly in the middle of the heart when i typed in like spring springish earrings a lot of like butterfly stuff came up, but I, I, I enjoy butterflies. And then these are probably my favorite besides, besides the owls that Kennedy got me. Um, it's a little black cat in a teacup. I don't know, hopefully this is focusing. I don't know, I thought that was just so cute and different. And the, the design on them, like the painting on it, I still can't figure out my glasses is pretty good. I, don't know, I thought those were cute. So those are my earrings I got from Timu. So those are my gifts. Um, it is snowing again right now. It snowed last year on my birthday. But that's about it. That's been going on. Uh, so I'm going to try to make that cake today. I didn't pull anything out for dinner. We might go, me and Adam might go grab a bite to eat. I'm not sure. Maybe go to get frozen yogurt. I don't know. He's at work. He's actually at the doctor's right now and then probably going back to work. Um, and maybe I'll go get my nails done. I've already had a kiddo calling me saying that, can I come pick them up? They don't feel good. I'm like, are you serious? Besides Allie downstairs, I'm like, it's kind of a day where the kids were at school. I thought, well, if I don't go anywhere, maybe I'll just color, you know, work on my planner. I already got a kid calling me saying that they don't feel good, which I don't know, they, they probably don't because it's been going around. Um, real quick before I sign off, I'm going to show you, we decorated for Easter, took St. Patrick's Day down. Uh, Easter decorations is the least amount I have, I, or the least stuff I have. I feel like I say that about every holiday, <laughs> but I, we really don't have a lot of Easter stuff. So I got a little Easter thing going on here with my gnomes and look at I had a gnome from last year that I forgot I bought so I put them there and Kennedy made me this out of a McDonald's cup 
that's a little sign from Timu. And my mom bought me the, the basket of flowers last year. So there's that. Then I stuck some bunny ears and some eggs right there. That's actually a salt and pepper shaker. We are thinking about maybe getting a bigger TV out here. This one's breaking, it doesn't work right. Uh, the fireplace isn't working, so we might do a little bit of remodeling right here. Again, like that's one of the things we're gonna discuss too, to see like money-wise and but see, this is it. This is all the Easter stuff that I have. But it's cute. I like that one. I believe I bought these last year. But that is it. That's our Easter stuff. Oh, my husband fixed my other lamp. Finally, it's only been a year. <laughs> So we put that back out. Uh, yeah, that's it. I got some window clings. Doesn't feel like Easter weather, but there you have it. Look at from the dog getting on the couch. Oh, the pillow covers that I showed you from Timu. Worked out really nice. Oh, there's this little placemat from the Dollar Tree, but I just stuck it there because it's so thin, it slides everywhere, so I didn't really know where to put it. But that is it. Well, I can't see, I just took my glasses off. Happy birthday to me, 47, almost 50. But I'm thankful for my family and for my health for the most part and for all the blessings that God has given me and showed you Mrs. My Dad. Okay guys, chicken tendies, make sure to leave me a comment. I love hearing from you and I'll try to be better about posting this week. Love ya, bye.